Don't no, pull the hammy. Someone forgot to stretch. <laughs> And the first two kids I'm going to use it on are you! That's what you think! Hey, I was taking a nap! My turn's kids into adults! I wonder what it turns adults into! <laughs> There's your answer. Tina! Cheryl! Oh, are you okay? Mommy, sorry. Let's have a little posh and off to bed. Boys! Mom! We defeated the miniature and saved all the children of the world. Well, except for Bob. On the bright side, I hear he has a thriving insurance business. You know what? I say we celebrate with some pizza and video games. Oh, guys, I'm sorry, but the phone's been ringing all night. Apparently, a lot of people need your help. Let's see. There's a bus on a broken suspension bridge. Ooh, I think I'd start with the giant spider that's climbing City Hall. Oh, we just ate the mayor. Oh, do we have to do it now? We wanted to go to Mr. Cheesy's Happy Pizza Place. I'm sorry, sweetie, but with superpower comes super responsibility. There's no time for kid stuff. Okay, I guess we'll go. Oh, wait! I gotta get your sweaters. You know, being a superhero really stinks. I wish we never made that wish. Wait a minute. If you run us around the Earth at supersonic speed, we can reverse its rotation, thus sending us back in time to the exact moment we saw the shooting star. Great idea! Ah, easy! I didn't get super strength! I think you ran us back a little too far. You think? Come on! We wished upon a star, we got superpowers, and we saved all the children of the world by defeating Mosby and his evil minions. How could you not remember something like that? I don't remember it because you dreamt it. You know what? Something must have happened when we went through the time vortex. Or you ate three pieces of cold pepperoni pizza right before you went to bed. Uh, hello, I do that every night. <sighs> Look, I'm telling you, Arwen built Mosby this adultifier. Wow. You'd think he'd never seen an atomic toilet plunger before. 